Hi guys, I'm Nepal and this is Gabby and we are the Travel Maker Queens and we arrived to So after traveling for three weeks in northern Lao and riding way too many long hour buses, we decided to get to the south of Lao by a flight, and we arrived to a location that we feel like is a secret well kept, the 4,000 Islands. It is not an obvious travel destination, even for people who are traveling Lao, so we wanted to make a short video and share this secret, because this place is absolutely magical. Let us show you what we mean. Wanna go rent a bike, baby? Let's do it. We stayed in Dundet, where we rented a bike to ride the island and even visit the neighbor island, Dan Khan. So there are some stuff you can do, but you don't really need to do anything. Gazing at the beautiful scenery around the island, the river and sky is more than enough. Let your mind relax and take you wherever it wants to wander. The islands are basically the perfect place to chill and explore. Just ride your bike and stop to watch all of the wonders along the way. Kids playing, amazing views, lots of animals walking around and a tropical temple. This is also the best place to experience the most breathtaking sunsets we ever seen. We didn't miss even one. There is just something unexplainable and wonderful about this place. The 4000 islands are basically a natural wonder. They are a nickname to small pieces of land that the Mekong River spreads into. Yes, a river, not an ocean. There is even a beautiful so-called beach you can go to to swim and play with local kids. The islands are very charming and peaceful, and our few days there felt like a healing experience. And Gabby, don't forget the food. The food there was the best we had in the entire country of Lao. Everything is fresh and extremely affordable, so we just couldn't stop eating. So thanks for watching guys, we have left Lao already and landed in our next destination. Please subscribe to continue following our journey, like and comment your feedbacks, it means a lot to us.